Well, it's a little bit unusual for a coal miner to end up governor of any place. From the coal mines to the governor's mansion, Paul Patton's inspiring journey revealed in new memoir. For about three or four years, I've been working with a professor from the University of Kentucky to write sort of a memoir of my life, uh, the early childhood, uh, business uh, in the coal business, but primarily about my time in Frankfurt as the governor and, and then here at the University of Pikeville as president. So it's, uh, it's pretty well uh, an entire story of my life, not all of it, but most of it. The coal miner who became governor opens with the first two chapters dedicated to Patton's early life and his time in the coal mine. It shows me like I, like I was. I, I worked uh, as a coal miner for about 10 years. I worked underground. I, 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 I was certified by informant. I bossed uh, at times when I had to. Cancer, it's a very scary word. But an outstanding treatment facility was here at home. I was led to the Lawson Cancer Center. As a nurse practitioner at the Lawson Cancer Center, we are champions for our patients. I am so happy for Robert. The treatment worked. Make it through the day, make it through the day. The remainder of the memoir is dedicated to Patton's political journey, shedding light on the pivotal moments and decisions that propelled him through the ranks in Kentucky politics. A person from Eastern Kentucky can be progressive. Somebody from Eastern Kentucky can uh, win a gubernatorial race and do a good job. I had a very practical approach to government, got very much deeply involved in it, and, uh, and I was experienced. I had... Uh, because after 20 years in the coal business, I spent 10 years as a county judge in Pike County. And uh, that caused me to understand the difference between business and government. You hear people say, run government like a business. Well, government is not a business. Government is a service. The memoir's official release is scheduled for November. Readers eager to gain deeper insights into Paul Patton's political journey are encouraged to keep an eye out for announcements regarding book signings in their area. Reporting from Mountaintop News, I'm Ethan Miller.